Hey, Lester. Mike, hey, uh, I'm transferring your cut of the jewel store take to your account. Madrazo's already got the house money, so you can rest easy there. <laughs> ah, thank God for that. What's up? Shut the fuck up and get ready for the opportunity hey, what's going of on, a brother? lifetime. Well, my man sure loves a bustieri. Does Inspector Nicker sell those? Davy, how you doing? About as good as can be expected. But the news is not good. I don't know what you're talking about. I know you did that fucking jewelry job. Davy, seriously, you're imagining things. Fuck you. All right. I did it. Arrest me. You know what? You'll be saving my life. Because you called it, motherfucker. What? You called it. Trevor. A couple days ago. But we haven't really talked about anything either. But if no when he starts asking questions about why you're not feeding worms south of the Canadian border. Oh, we got problems. Yeah, no shit. <sighs> We're in it. Together. So, if your problems are my problems, then I guess that means that my problems are sort of your problems. <laughs> uh-uh. Nope. What if I lose my job? Someone comes into my office, starts reading my files. They'll see the things I did. I know a lot of stuff. I can cop a plea, get five years, but you... Fuck you, you ungrateful prick. I made your career. Well... Then we better go about saving it together, because... You and I both know we can't let it go to shit now. What do you need? This guy. Ferdinand Karamov. The agency claims he's dead. We at the Bureau think they're full of crap. We think he's being debriefed someplace. So? Apparently, he has information which will put me and my superiors out of circulation. Those agency fuckers have got the coroner's office locked down. We need you to verify the body. So how the hell am I gonna get in here? Well, you've played dead before, haven't you? I have always kind of liked you. Call me when you wake up. I'll tell you what to do. What we got? Uh, John Doe, white male, overweight, in his late 40s, possible coroner. Let's take a peek. The fat deposits on his hips and abdomen suggest a fondness for bleeder burgers. We're probably about to find one in his gut, still in its wrapper. Right next to the bottle of scotch and pack of redwoods. See the broken capillaries around the nose? Alcoholic. I wouldn't take any bets on the state of the liver. We still think 40s? Takes a toll. He's an advert for clean living. Note the discoloration of the teeth and the fingers. Smoker. Pack a day, I'd say. Probably cigars, too. I was going like there was no tomorrow. Yeah, he's got that right. Some people think they're immortal. So you get chest pains pumping away at your mistress. Lucky girl having this thing on top of her, huh? She was probably relieved when he bought it. Awkward conversation with the spouse. Might have got some hush money. It's a win-win. Only losers are the chumps who've got to cut him open to rule cause of death. Ah! Oh, Jesus! Ah! Back from the dead, ah! motherfucker! Ah! 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 Come out! Hands in the air! Come on. Might be in the other room. Out! Now! Out of there!
That don't look right. Guess you can't judge a corpse by its toe tag. I found the toe tag. Ferdinand Karamov. It's on some big black lady. Definitely not your guy. Okay. The agency have the lower floors on lockdown to prevent a leak. I got a guy who can cut the power to give you some help. But you'll have to get upstairs if you're gonna get out. You! Freeze! Ah, you're dead! Trust me! I'm not interested in the truth! I should have stayed on the slab! <clears throat> hey! You're a threat to national security! <laughs> Shit! Need to take the stairs! We're on lockdown! It's all a big misunderstanding! Yeah! You die! <laughs> this the way out? This is fuck. I don't know what you're doing here, but you won't be doing it much longer. Man down. You're done. Just you let me you go. Backup for a possible national security threat at Strawberry Corner's office. Suspect is a white male adult. 
Hey, Mike. F. Hey, we need to talk. Quick, meet me at those oil derricks just outside town, El Burro Heights. And make sure you're not tailed. Man, that don't sound too good, homie. Look, I'm on my way. Dave, the hell was that? You know how many spooks I just ran into? I'm sorry. They're not nice people if that's a consolation. What's going on? There's a big target out there. Something in the shadows. The data algorithms are reading off the charts. Whoever finds it, the Bureau or the agency, is gonna get a big bump in funding. Like I care about your funding. I'm out, Dave. You're not. I need you to meet my boss. We'll be downtown in the plaza between the FIB and the IAA buildings. The IAA building? You fucking kidding me after the spat I just had with those agency men? Relax. They won't be looking there. They never expect an inside job. What's going on? You gotta get out of town. Man, I ain't exactly got nowhere to go. Well, then take a trip. A long trip. What the fuck is going on? Things, all right? Look, you remember, I told you I know people. Feds who looked after me when I retired. You did? Yeah, I did. I mean, I think I did. I don't know. Shit, Jesus Christ, Franklin. I got so many stories, I can't even keep them straight. I'm full of shit. Yeah, but your full of shit got me a lot of paper. One score with you, I made more money than I ever did hustling. 
Oh, yeah, I mean, I'm a great thief, but you know, it's the other shit that I ain't got figured out. So what's the deal, man? What's the deal with the Bureau, man? This clown. I mean, he's an okay guy. Fucking cocksucker. We did a deal a long time ago. Didn't go quite the way it was supposed to go. Wrong guy got killed. So I had to go into kind of a, an informal witness protection program. He helped me. I didn't reveal secrets of his. And everything was cool. The problem started when recently I became unretired. I mean, he shows up, starts calling in favors, telling me to do shit. I mean, look, Franklin, I'm working for the fucking feds. Oh, fuck, man. Oh, fuck, man. Yeah, and that ain't even the worst part. <sighs> Did I ever tell you about Trevor? Hmm? Uh, man, I, I think so, shit. Well, if you only think so, then I wasn't being completely honest. He's, I don't, hell walking on Earth. That's what he is. Well, let's bury this motherfucker. Oh, yeah, good luck with that. Shit. I mean, Trevor and I got history. Complicated fucking history. Look, I've done a lot of things that I ain't proud of. Okay, I never claimed to be an angel. But you meet Trevor Franklin, you'll swear I am an angel. So what's the mood in, man? I don't know. Fuck. I'm just gonna, you know, try to play both sides. You know, until I can find a way out of this shit. All right, man, look, man, you help me. The way I see it, man, the least I can do is help you. It's a death sentence, Franklin. Man, I, I, I ain't trying to hear all that shit, man. If the Bureau ain't gonna take you to court, them motherfuckers just hustlers anyway. And I ain't finna let no motherfucking cat think he's so motherfucking crazy, run me up a tree. Fuck that. Hey, you're a good kid, Franklin. This means a lot to me. Like I told you, I'm a terrific thief. I'll find something for you. Big. Now come on. You better take off. All right, man. I'm with you. I'm with you. What is wrong with you smoking in my house? You know, ever since that psychotic pal of yours turned up, you've turned into an even bigger asshole. Thank you. Your support in my difficult times means the world to me. I've supported you. I left everything to come here with you, and still, that crazy bastard turns up. I'll handle it. How? I don't know. Oh, you know what? Just keep him away from me and the children, you low-life, whoremongering asswipe. Did someone say yoga? No, I think she said whore monitoring asswipe. Hello, Fabian, darling. <laughs> Namaste, Amanda. Are we ready to practice? Yes. Oh, yes, she's very centered. A regular you oasis see what I of live peace and tranquility, this with one. with anger issues and worse friends. No you... wonder I'm so upset. You too, please. Namaste. We practice. Miguel, join us, please. No, please, no. No, please. No. The yoga is for sharing. Come, come, Miguel, come. Awesome. So, Fab, if you can make me as happy and mellow as my wife, it'll be a job well fucking done. We are all on our own journeys, Miguel. Yeah, no doubt. So why is she driving a tank on hers? Perhaps to deal with your hostility, Michael. Now here is good. We have the sun and the moribunda. The asshole. Now we begin to put the asshole to the earth. Yes, we begin each sequence. Tadasana. Yes. Or mountain pose. All right. Un, deux, trois. Mouth and anus are perfectly in line. Show him, Amanda. Un, deux, trois. It is perfect. Now, Michael. I don't know about this. Now, in through the bloated nose and out through those wrinkled lips. Out through those wrinkled lips. Strength, Michael. 
In and out with the breath, Mikhail. Maybe there's hope for him. A small, tiny, minuscule, maybe. Air through the nose and out the mouth. <sighs> Who would have thought it possible? This is gonna have to do. Now we will do something more complicated. Sometimes, when I do this pose, I weep uncontrollably for hours. Wow. <laughs> you feel that? The emotion inside. Let it go. <laughs> Michael, join us. I feel like I'm channeling bullshit right now. You can breathe, can't you? Let it go. There! Let it go! The silly man forgets to breathe. There. There it is. Breathe, Mikkel. Let it out. You feel that? Now. You breathe. He's got great core strength for someone who's totally rotten there. Yeah, I'm about to feel some emotions, all right. Remember, children, do not fear the unknown. We are the unknown. Show us, Amanda. I don't think Michael's up to this. Hmm, he may surprise you. Plank. Plank. Chaturanga. Chata, yeah. Feel the flow. <clears throat> Everything <clears throat> is flowing in me. <sighs> Mike, would you? <sighs> I hope there is time for yoga to save you. Take in the air and release it, out with the breath. When we met, he was actually limber. Your lungs, they work, yes? Can you thank us now for saving you from the couch? Breathing is almost the most important thing, no? Out through the mouth. Hold the anus. Breathe, please, Michael. Fabian's body with your bank account would be the perfect man. Take in the air and release it. Out through the mouth. Okay. Your lungs, they work, yes? If it's too much, just go into child's pose. Breathing is almost the most important thing, no? Exhale. Your aura is just like, wow! <sighs> you have come a long way today, Mikael. Huh? Yes, later you will cry like a baby. Yeah, right. His chakras are completely blocked. Don't worry about him. Show me the downward dog. I'm glad we have helped with your impotence, Mikael. What'd you say? Your sexual energies have been blocked for too long. Back into my pelvis. Back. What? Back, back. Yes, there you go. Mm, oh, 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 oh! What? Hey, enough of that shit! Ah! Ah! Yoga is the answer, Mikael. But what is the question? Uh, why am I such a moron? We are leaving and we are never coming back! Good! You are alone, you pathetic psychopath! Ugh, fuck you! And that phony French fucking yogi! Ah! J 
Jimmy! You still here? James! Go away! Oh yeah, fuck you! You know what? If there was a rape button, I'd be using it right now. Unless you're a faggot and you like that sort of shit. It's nice TV. Did I pay for that? Yeah, you smashed the other one, didn't you? All right, come on. I want to go for a ride. I gotta meet a friend. All right, so I'll go meet him with you. Come on, I want to get out of the house. I'm not going alone. Come on. This is fucking bullshit. Bullshit? Threatening to molest your online buddies is bullshit. They're not my buddies. They're the only people you speak to. Where's your friend? Burger shot. Yeah, nice to see the kids are still hanging out at the Nice to see the kids are still hanging out at the burger joints. Me and the guys, we'd go down to the diner after class every day. You know, get milkshakes, fries. Ew, please. You know, you're really creeping me out. I'm trying to relate to you. No. You're trying to take me on some nostalgia trip. You're such a cliche. Oh, says the dope smoking, game playing, live at home world owes him a living millennial. I knew it. I knew it. The mask was gonna slip. The monster's been exposed. The hell are you talking about? The real you. That bitter, vindictive old man. You pretend you're being a father, but you hate me, don't you? I don't hate you, Jim. How many times? I love you. Look, I'm sorry if I don't express that correctly, but why do you think we're here together? You really have to meet my friend? Yeah, I really do. Then please don't get weird. For once in your life, don't be weird. <coughs> Yo, oh, bro, man, what's, man? Up? What's, what's up? What's up, man? Good to see you. What are you, turning tricks to pay for this shit, huh? Hey, who's the old man? It's my dad. Oh, all right, Mr. DeSanto. <laughs> yeah, you the kid selling Jimmy pot by the pound? Ooh. <laughs> ah, Jimmy, bro, your dad's funny, man. Come on, do this shit and let's get going. Oh, yeah, you, you got that other thing? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, man, what the fuck, Jimmy? Just, just hold on a second. Oh, all right, all right, later on. Careful with that. Hey, let's bounce. Bounce. We're bouncing now. Is that what we're doing? Jesus fucking Christ. Alrighty then. Now what? Can we just get back to the house, please? So, uh, want a drink? I'm driving. Because normally you're such a between the white lines, friend to the pedestrian kind of guy. Fine. Give it here. Hey, you! Hey, man. <laughs> okay, your turn. Maybe when we get home. Ah, who's the square now? <laughs> I'm starting to feel a little woozy. You're fine. No. Really, this is not normal. Chill out. You're just paranoid. This is not paranoia. This is totally justified <laughs> concern. You should see yourself. Would you quit being such a drama queen and get us to the house? Just chill. I gotta stop. Oh, who was in it? It's harmless. Vets have been using it for decades. What? You anesthetize me? You're I'm protecting shit. you from yourself. Also, I took money from your bank account and I'm moving out. What? All right. You're too crazy, Dad. Come on! Yeah. <laughs>
Michael, I think you've finally lost your mind. Your recent behavior and the company you've been keeping already had me very concerned. Now you've taken to attacking my Fabian, who was a close friend, and then Jimmy said you took drugs while driving him in your car. Well, we've decided to move out for a while. You promised me you'd change, and you haven't changed a bit. I know you say I always act like I'm in a movie. Well, this isn't that. I think I'm gonna speak to a lawyer. I'm just really confused. Please, don't try to contact us and try not to get yourself killed. Amanda. <laughs> 